Hello, my name is Paul Castle and these are the lunchtime headlines from the Reading Post. Plans for a landmark 25-storey office building opposite Reading Station appear to have fallen on wobbly ground. Councillors are concerned about a delay in a planning application for a new skyscraper to replace the ugly brown Thames Tower block in the town centre. The final member of a criminal gang convicted for illegally selling prestige hire cars and running a cannabis factory has been ordered to pay back more than £40,000. Judge Peter Ross ordered Fias Asgar to pay back the cash following an application by Thames Valley Police under the Proceeds of Crime Act. A mother has called for help in finding the man responsible for attacking her 12-year-old son at a bus stop. Sonia Walker from Whitley said her son was attacked after getting into a row with a man in Reading Town Centre last month. And in sport, Reading are among the early favourites to win promotion back to the Premier League next season. Nigel Atkins' side are in the running along with QPR and Leicester. Thanks for watching and don't forget to pick up your copy of the Reading Post tomorrow.